So we got another uh, walk and talk going. And uh, long time patron and great friend, uh, Joe McLeod, asked about our kitten. And how am I, uh, how have I adapted to having a kitten? So it's been a year now since we found her and she was born around Halloween of last year. So I don't know legally if that's still a kitten, but, um, there, here, here, here she is before I start walking. There she is. She's like licking, licking her paw, cleaning her head. So she is on her, this is a, um, a hammock that my wife bought her for Christmas. So she hangs out in our bedroom and watches things and you know because the cat's spoiled i don't have a hammock so yeah so the, the cat hangs out on the hammock and um i'm gonna walk now and sleeps or just watches the woods behind the house and then in the front in our dining room we have a dining room chair turned facing the window with a uh, a towel on it for her so that mary can um watch out that window and then in my office i always have to have the shade pulled up because she likes to climb in that window between the computer and the desk and the window so she has um every window in this house the blinds are up so she can frequent them which is uh, nice do i like having a cat around yeah a lot more than i thought i was going to um, she hangs out in my office a lot. I only let her in there when I'm in there. And, uh, so she sleeps in her Red Sox giant, uh, cap sleeper bed in my office now. And at night she'll lay on the blanket on top of my wife and sleep. And then... She likes to fetch hair ties. So, like, as I'm just walking around, there's, like, five or six of them in random spots. She hides them a lot. Then we don't have any. And then, all of a sudden, like, three of them appear out of nowhere. And we throw them over the couch near the door, and she jumps over everything, hops like a rabbit to get them. So, she's a lot of fun. She is playful. She likes to, uh, she likes when you chase her. So she's not like, and she's not like a big fat cat. She won't get much bigger than she is now. So there you go. I never thought I'd be talking about owning a cat. But there it is. So thank you, Miss McLeod. Thank you, Miss McLean. Oh, wait, no, that's a diehard. Forget it. Um, for the question, keep them coming. A bunch more questions. It'll give me incentive to get up and walk. I might even start doing these two a week if I get enough questions in. So appreciate it.